Adventures with the Vikings Map, a math adventure based on the book Circumference in the Vikings Map by Cindy Neuschwander, movie by Hannah Marie Buster. One day, her and her cousin Radius were riding through the hillsides surrounding the kingdom of Angoland when they realized they were lost. Maps of Angoland are as rare as dogs with wings, said Radius. Maybe we'll be able to see where we are when we get to the top of the hill, replied Purr. Wow, the view is beautiful from up here, exclaimed Purr as they reached the top of the hill. It sure is, but nothing looks familiar. We are losing daylight. Let's camp over there tonight. The grass looks thick and soft, replied Radius. As the cousins head over to the grassy patch, they noticed a large tangle of brambles and vines blocking their way. Wait, what is that? Purr wonders out loud. It looks like a house built into that hill, exclaims Radius. Just in an addition, they hear what sounds like singing and laughter. Battle of Barney and a Brigadier's Band. We're the best on all the land. We sneak and we snatch whenever we can. We're a Battle Barbie and a Brigadier's Band. As the cousins listened to the distance, they could see the faint outline of a group of ragged men marching along. The cousins realized that they need to get inside the house before the band of highway robbers comes near. Purr grabbed a candle from her saddlebag, and the pair entered the house, slamming the door behind them. Hey, this looks like a map! Wonder if it could help us, wondered Purr. There's something written on the back. What does it say? Questioned Radius. Purr turned over the map and began to read. I, Gringus Inkle, scribe of this land, have drawn this map for Sasson Yellowbeard the Viking. He is to leave the path of most valued treasure, starting at three, zero, X, Y. Zaxxon Yellowbeard? Who is Zaxxon Yellowbeard? Questioned Purr. Radius began to explain to Purr who Zaxxon Yellowbeard was. Zaxxon Yellowbeard was only the fiercest Viking warrior ever. Legend has it that he conquered most of Angoland. I always thought he was just a legend, explained Radius. I guess he must be real, though. Are you ready to search for his treasure tomorrow? Continued Radius. Absolutely, responded Purr. How do we read this map? Radius began to wonder. Well, said Purr, it looks like we are right here. I think that the numbers three and zero at the bottom of the message tell us where to go. Well, said Radius, I see two different threes on this map, but no zero. It actually looks like the house in the hill is inside of zero, noticed Miss Purr. Let's head to the three that is up toward the top of the map, suggests Purr. The two head off on the journey north to the location where the three indicates. This doesn't seem right, observed Radius. Let's go back to the hill and try the other three. The pair heads back to the house in the hill to try again. Radius, exclaimed Purr. I found Zaxxon's initials carved on that pillar. There's another set of numbers, too. What is that sound? Oh, no, it's Barnaby's gang. We better get going. Purr and Radius run a safe distance from the footsteps and take a break to consult their map once again. It isn't safe to go back, Radius. What should we do? You were right. The first number tells us which way to go on the x ax We have to go back. When we get back to the second marker, we'll go down the y ax explained Radius. Purr and Radius return to the pillar in the woods and find that Barnaby's gang had moved on. Okay, let's head down towards the bottom of our map before they return. After traveling towards their next destination, Purr and Radius find themselves at the entrance to a cave. This must be a new location. We are going to need some light in there. Radius. After retrieving her candle from her saddlebag, Purr exclaimed, I have my candle, let's go! Upon entering the cave, Purr notices a pair of numbers on the cave wall. Look, there are next numbers! Before Radius has an opportunity to respond, the pair hears footsteps coming. I hear footsteps! exclaimed Radius. Blow out your candle and crouch down! Barnaby's gang enters the cave. Having chased Purr and Radius all day, they are tired and the darkness of the cave begins to wear on them. The gang decides it's time to lay down for a nap. Once the gang has fallen asleep, Radius whispers, Let's get out of here while they're sleeping. Her and Radius quietly sneak back to the entrance. Just as they reach the opening and what they thought to be safety, Her trips on some loose rocks and woke the whole gang back up again. After running what felt like miles, Her and Radius found themselves back at the house in the hill. Radius takes the map and begins to examine it. I think we lost them. Let's find our next destination. Negative three, negative three. Well, that is odd. It seems to be in a lake. Well, let's go. Her and Radius take off to continue their journey to find the treasure of Zaxxon Yellowbeard. Upon arriving at the lake, they notice a large rock in the middle. I bet the treasure is on that large rock out there. 
about that time, Fur noticed that Barnaby's gang coming closer and closer. Oh no! There's Barnaby's gang! Let's swim out there! Hopefully they can't swim! Fur and Radius swim out to the rocks, followed closely behind by Barnaby's gang, who does seem to be floundering in the water. About the time Fur and Radius reach the rocks, they hear a booming voice. Looking for treasure? They look to see a ghostly figure in the water. That, that, that's on Yellowbeard! Sandwich Radius. That's on Yellowbeard hands an axe like those on the maps of her and Radius. She also hands him a chest. This is the treasure of the greatest measure. Protect it! Booms Yellowbeard. As that time Yellowbeard leaves, Kern and Radius open the chest. Maps of old England! Exclaim Radius will never be lost again! Let's get this to safety right away! Using the maps that Zaxxon Yellowbeard gave them, Kerr and Radius finally find their way back home. Welcome back! Exclaimed Circumference Radius' his father. We were beginning to worry, added Lady Diabameter, Radius' his mother. We're fine. We found a cutting edge map, shared Radius. And use some sharp thinking to get a handle on our location, added Fur.